G'day everyone, welcome to another Better Communications Results. Today I'm here with Jeremy Haig, and Jeremy is uh, one of the people behind the very successful Skylock, which I've been using for years and years as an add-on to, uh, to Outlook. Um, and it connects Skype with Outlook, so you can make Skype calls to your Outlook contacts. And I've been using that for years. I think it's fantastic. Jeremy recently came up with a, a, a relatively new product, con comparing you know, in age from Skylook, but it, a, a product called Vodburner. It's been around about a year or so now, and uh, again, very, very successful product for them. And so I'm here with Jeremy today, just wondering if Jeremy can walk us through Vodburner and explain some of the, uh, some of the technicalities behind it, but some of the benefits that, of why people would want to use Vodburner, because I think it's a fantastic tool. So welcome, Jeremy. Uh, thanks, Lee. Thanks for having me on, and uh, nice to talk to a fellow Aussie uh, doing these sort of interviews for a change. I'm usually up at all hours, uh, either early or late, with you know Americans or people across Europe. So great to have somebody in my own uh, backyard. <laughs> yes, excellent. So uh, I can talk about what we're doing. Um, so we've been going now for seven years, actually, in May. Um, uh, it's all based in Melbourne. Um, all Australian made. Uh, Skylook, as you mentioned, was our first product. And really, probably in the last three years, um, Skype video has just exploded. Well, any video on the web, uh, you know, really. Um, it's doubling uh, in use year on year, I think. And Skype video um, is now, would you believe, on of, of all Skype calls, it's on over 40% uh, of every call has video on it, and over Christmas it goes over 50%. Uh, so it's uh, it's not so much now just getting on Skype, but it's getting on and uh, having a video uh, call with somebody. Laptops now, they all have the webcams um, built in uh, to them. You can Skype on your uh, iPhone with video. So it's a big opportunity, you know, uh, for us. And one of the, the limitations is Skype can let you record those video calls. So... Hence, we developed VodBurner, and really, VodBurner is about three things. There's the recording. Uh, we also have editing, so you can put in subtitles, and you can change the camera um, backwards and forwards to make it more like you would see on the 6 o'clock news, more like an interview format like this call uh, we're having now. Uh, and we also, the third thing is uh, we upload directly to YouTube. Um, all within the app, you put in your username and password, you can put tags and all those things when you, if you've ever uploaded a video on YouTube, the same deal, uh, and we put it uh, right up there. And we work all, all the different uh, standards up to now 1080 uh, video, which Skype have recently uh, announced that they're uh, supported, or they have supported, and there's some new webcams coming out now. There's a Logitech uh, C9, uh, C920 cam that does, would you believe, 1080 video um, cool. which is mind-blowing. Um, of course, you need the, the fast internet connection and uh, everything else to make that possible. It's a little bit tricky here in Australia with our internet connections, but uh, that's where it's at with VodBurner, and um, that's available at vodburner.com, and, uh, yeah, check it out. There's a free 14-day trial. And, and it's an excellent product. I'm, I'm, we're using it at the moment, of course, to uh, to record this call and to show you some of the features and benefits that uh, that come from editing within VodBurner. Um, Jeremy, how simple is it for someone to to go to VodBurner.com and download and install the software? Is there a lot of technical complexity? No, it's really simple. It's a uh, easy to uh, put on your computer. You just uh, you install it. Um, it just bolts itself onto Skype. So you need uh, Skype as well, um, and then it sees everything that Skype sees with your video calls. Um, you can have it record all your video calls or just on demand when you want it to, um, and you just operate Skype like you normally would. Um, it's not a big learning curve or anything like that, um, and we've deliberately designed it uh, to be graphical, so the editing um, is is very intuitive. There's not you don't have to save things or open projects or anything like that. It's, so it's it's what us nerds call sticky. So you change something in there and it's remembered next time you go in, um, all that sort of thing. 
Uh, it detects whether your video quality is HD or the standard definition. Um, we also do group video calls. So with Skype now, you can have a Brady Bunch thing uh, going on a call. We do not nine people if you if you wanted to, <laughs> and uh, and we record that as well. So it's very uh, you know easy to use, and uh, you know not, certainly nothing re- you really need to learn or. Uh, you know, look, some video pr- programs can be really, you know, bombard you with, ex- you know, a lot of technical sort of options, but we keep it very simple. But that doesn't mean that it's not powerful. It's uh, simple and powerful. For, you know, you can do what you want it to do. Mm. I, no- I noticed because I hang out on the uh, the Google Plus in, in a community in Google Plus, and the the, the Hangouts um, within Google Plus have become very very popular. That's the video where you're talking about you've got lots of people up on a call. Um, now you're saying that Skype allows that as well, but the benefit of VodBurner is that you can actually record those Hangouts, so you can record those conversations. Yeah, so that's right. Google uh, Hangouts does have the recording. Um, I haven't tried that out, but um, I, I believe you can't do editing or anything. Uh, it's fairly sort of rudimentary, you know, at least now. Uh, that might change over time, but Skype doesn't have uh, the recording capability. So, you know, you need to get a third-party, um, you know, product like Vodburner to, to get in there and, and record and do the editing for you. Mm. What about uh, uh, when you're recording, what sort of impact is there on the computer? Does it slow right down to the point where it's unusable or, or can you do stuff in the background? Or So what we have with VodBurner is um, we've designed it to work on very low uh, spec computers because when we record the video, we're not doing any of the heavy lifting at that point. Once your video call's recorded, um, you then can view and edit the video call and that might take a few minutes to open up the the video and that's when it's doing all the heavy lifting, um, you know, rendering and all those sorts of um, hard lifting, heavy lifting video uh, things that it needs to do. So we do that after the call so we don't affect the quality of your Skype video call. If you've got a newer, um, some of the new uh, Intel um, processors that have Sandy Bridge, uh, on the i5 and i7 processors, um, the generation two ones of them, we don't have that step at all because those computers are fast enough to just do it. Um, and that's you know that's not a lot of money these days. That's you know like five to eight hundred dollars uh, for a computer that, that is really fast now. Mm. Uh, it's just crazy how cheap that stuff's getting. So you know in a couple of years that'll sort of be the norm, and uh, we'll be able to do a lot more. Um, you know rendering and stuff but we have designed it so it works on the older ones um, as well it just might take a little bit longer to to edit the to open up the video call after you've recorded it hmm. I, I know that with with a number of uh, the clients that I've got is that they do have older computers um, you know renewing and updating their computers isn't high on their list of things to do so uh, they do have old computers so I like the fact that all the all the the background stuff is done after the call. It doesn't interrupt the call. It doesn't sort of slow the call down, and you end up with the the horrible dialogue here and the and the mouth over here. The sort of like the the Italian westerns or the <laughs> uh, the Japanese westerns. Um, so so that's excellent. Now, one other thing that I need you to to demonstrate to the audience is how cool the mug of tea that you're drinking is. <laughs> See if uh, your viewers can read that. Absolutely clear as a bell. <laughs> keep glam and rock on. That's brilliant. Hasn't that meme taken off? You know the uh, keep calm and keep shopping sort of meme. Hasn't that taken off around the world? Yes, and I can't take full credits for that mug because my wife actually bought that, so I have to pay props to Kate. Yeah, <laughs> yeah but uh, but yes, very very cool indeed. But getting back to Vod Burner. Um, the, 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 so it's it's so as I understand it, it's very easy to download, very easy to install. Uh, it just it's, it's, it, it plugs in itself and, and meshes nicely with Skype, so you don't have to worry about any of, of that sort of interface with Skype. It just all seamlessly integrates together. Uh, you then record the call, and it's very seamlessly recorded. Can you record in different qualities, or is there just a single quality that it records at? So what happens with Skype is if your internet connection suddenly has a burst where it's really fast, the Skype video will get really clear and the, the quality goes up. Um, 
So what Vodvana does is we're always recording that increased quality, and if it comes down again, we, we come down with it. So we've developed some smarts where you don't set Vodvana to what you want it to do. It just does whatever Skype's doing. Okay. Um, and if you've got one of these new cams that does you know 1080 video, uh, we, we do that as well. So it's always adjusting you know, on the, on the fly, which can happen on Skype calls sometimes. You know, it can slow right down and speed right up, but mm. we design it to work specifically with that in mind. Yeah, there's an evil person somewhere in the world who's got this, this sort of like the, the trigger that, and they're, they're screwing down on Skype so it doesn't run smoothly and then they'll lift it back off again just when you finished your call. I, yes. I've, I've, I've had that happen to me. Yeah. Um, or it can be a, a daughter, uh, you know, my 20 year old daughter lives with us and uh, sometimes she's, you know, doing, being down big files or whatever in our connection and uh, that can slow it down too. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. I've got a, I've got a 20 year old stepson who does the same thing and uh, yeah, suddenly your internet connection goes, it's absolutely horrible. Yes. Um, so then the editing process, that's fairly simple, is it? Yep, so the editing, it's, what it actually does, the cool thing about Vodburner is uh, it listens to who's talking, so if you start off, it puts your head on the video, and then once I start, it puts me on the video. So it changes the cameras uh, for you to make more of a interesting video rather than just two boxes side by side. So it works all that out for you, and then you can go in and tweak it. Uh, you can add in subtitles. If it's for your business, you can put in uh, logo, that sort of thing. Um, you can even in put video inside there, so like a intro video, to, to the video if you're like a I mean we've got customers that are big on YouTube and they're you know got channels on, on YouTube and they have a uh, in, intro for their videos that they do and so it does all that stuff in the editing you can also trim and take out um, bits of the video that you might not want um, and once you're done with that you can put it up to YouTube but you don't have to put it up to YouTube you can also export it to a video file um, MPEG-4 or something like that if you wanted to watch it, uh, you know, later. Say if you're overseas and you're, you're reading your son a story, good night, you don't want that to go up you, on YouTube necessarily, so you don't have to do the whole YouTube thing. Yeah. No, that's excellent. That's an excellent idea. All righty. Any... Um, and then, so, yeah, you can very quickly up, uh, output it to um, to a video format, upload it to YouTube or save it on your desktop for later use. That's That's well cool. Um, that all sounds to me as though it's a package that anyone would want and they'd be foolish not to get. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm sold. <laughs> um, so what was the website that I need to go to again? So it's www.vod, so V-O-D, burner.com. Um, we're also on Twitter um, fairly regularly. That's our we're, we're Vod Burner on Twitter. We're on, we're on Facebook. We're all on all the, the normal things these days. But um, VodBurner.com is where you get it and download it from. Excellent, Jeremy. Thank you so much for your time today. Really do appreciate it. I'm going to now finish this call and go and edit it within uh, within Vod Burner, uh, and then stick it up on YouTube. Excellent. Well, we'll RT it on our Twitter. <laughs> okay, excellent. Thanks very much. Thanks very much, Jeremy. Bye-bye. See ya.